Okay, let's see if I can just lay this cloth out. I put some of this freezer paper, butcher paper down, just kind of so that as I cut each piece and start getting the layup ready, I can uh, roll it up to keep it clean. Because what will happen is I'll get all the sheets cut and then uh, start working on the mirror to get it, it cleaned off as, as good as I can and then start putting the release agent on. So this is really just prep work that's happening here to get the sheets. So I want enough room here on the edge going around the edge of this glass to be able to put down the, the sealant tape. So probably I'll leave enough there. Let's see how wide this is. I think this is three foot wide cloth. Yep, that's 36 inches. So the sheet that I make will probably be something like 36 by, we'll just say 30. Any snags or anything like that. This trix cloth is pretty easy to work with, although it does leave a little sheds little pieces like from the edge if you're not too careful. So I'm gonna start cutting right about here. Quite a bit of fuzzies right there, for whatever reason. What I'll do here is just try and kind of roll it, wrap it, maybe fold it like this. Like that. Those are the two layers of that stuff. Just try and 
keep it neat until I'm ready to, ready to go with it. Okay. Just want to keep that laying out here, getting all dirty or dusty or possibility of getting snagged. That should try and keep that neat until I'm ready to use it. Let's set this over on the side. So the thing that goes next in the layup, layup is the peel ply. I'm using fiberglass econo stitch peel ply. I like this stuff because it has the, the red threads on it, so when the uh, epoxy comes in, the resin starts infusing, you can still see it. Just like fiberglass, this stuff goes almost clear. So when you're all done, it's easier to see the layer of peel ply. So, so that is 30 inches wide, so that'll be good. So I can lay this out this way. And literally, literally, this is what goes right against the cloth. The cloth goes down on the glass, then this goes on top, top of the cloth. It's uh, The resin can uh, go through it, permeate it. Then when you're done, you peel that off, peel apply. You peel that off and it leaves a good surface that uh, the epoxy can stick to when you stick it onto something else. So. And this is the backing film, the vacuum film that goes on top. And it's actually a tube. We're just going to use it on top. So, what I'll do is cut the width. Well, actually, yeah, I cut the width to like. It's going to have to cover the whole plate, so we need to be generous with this. So let's go. Okay. 
basically laying this up on this mirror rather than on a, in, a, in a bag. What I'll do is I'll slit this and then we'll fold it open. on the uh, on the glass here get release agent on it make sure it's super clean 